Hello friends and welcome to the tutorial of Python for the beginners. In this tutorial, we will learn how to install Python IDLE to learn Python. So, let's start. First of all, just go to your favorite browser and click on it. And now open Google. And search here for the Python and just click enter so you can see the first link here welcome to the python.org so just click on here or directly click here on the download button so just click here download so that we can download our Python file here you can see there are different versions of the python that we can use so just click any of the version which you want so just click here on the first that is python 3.6.4 just click here and now go here in the files and there you can see the versions or means on which operating system you want to install it so according to that you can download your preferred version and this 64 represent that it is for the 64 bit and these three are for the 32 bit processor so mine is 64 bit so i will just click on this windows x86 64 executable installer so just click here and it will ask you to save the file so just click save file and it will start to download i will not save it because i already have this version so i will just cancel it and i will directly install it from here so this is the version which i have already downloaded so just double click on it and now it is asking you to install now or for the custom installation so before starting the installation just click on this checkbox that is add python 3.6 to path it means it will automatically add the path of the python folder to your environment means it will automatically set the environment path so i will just check it and now i will click on install now It will take some time to install. So now you can see our installation is done. So it is displaying me one message setup was successful. So just click on close and let's check whether our installation is complete or not just type here IDLE if it will show you this option IDLE Python 3.6 64-bit it means your installation is successful so just click on it so if on clicking on that option if Python shell is being opened that means your python has been successfully installed on your system so this was it for this video and we will start with the python session from the next video and thanks for watching my video